welcome to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. Uh, this is part of yung aptitude test help na ginagawa ko. So videos on math, language, and logic if you're taking an exam. Or if you just want to learn, I hope that my videos help you out. And if this is the first video that you're watching, don't forget to hit subscribe and hit the bell icon para malaman niyo as soon as a new video posts. I make multiple videos every week unless I'm really, really sick. So uh, I hope na makatch niyo yung susunod na video. Okay? Now, itong video right here is actually a quick quiz paired to a lesson that I posted earlier. So if hindi nyo pala papanood yung lesson, I suggest that you watch it first bago nyo to sagutan para makuha ninyo yung technique that I'm going to show you here. Kasi pag hindi nyo napanood yung video na yon, baka pag nakita ninyo kung paano ko sinosolve yung quiz, makonfuse kayo lalo. So if you haven't seen that yet, you can click dito sa taas, dun sa i button, para malaman ninyo pag, uh, kung paano gamitin yung chunking na te technique that I was talking about. Okay? Now, etong uh, quiz na ito, there will be five questions. The first uh, set will be just regular na chunking questions and then the last one would be problem solving. So, I really hope that you um, can figure out the answers really fast. So, I, for the first four na questions, I'm going to give you a minute for each problem just so we can practice. And then for the last question, I'm going to give you two minutes because it's going to be a little more complicated. Okay? So, you have a total of six minutes for this quiz. And then at the end, I'm going to explain kung paano siya sagutin and how I do it kung ako yung nage-exam. Okay? So, if you're ready, your timer starts now.
All right, let's see how you did. Okay, so isa-isayin lang natin siya. Again, we're going to use yung technique. Um, if you prefer using the traditional method, if you find yourself faster doon, pwede rin naman. Uh, ang sa akin lang is, I'm trying my best to teach you all of the tricks that I use para hopefully may matulungan ako na someone out there. All right? So isa-isayin natin na to. Ito yung first page natin. We have four questions. Isosolve natin ang isa-isa sila lahat. Again, using yung chunking technique. All right, uh, tingnan natin to number one, 47 plus 38. Again, we're going to just just fill in yung information na dito. So, yung 38, dalawa na lang yan. 40 na rin yan. So, what I can do here would be I turn this into 40. Ito, babawasan ko ng dalawa kasi kinuha natin, lagay natin doon. This will be 45. So, on total, magiging 85. So, again, the more you practice this, the faster you'll get. Kaya, kung lagi nyo siyang ginagamit, mas magiging automatic siya sa inyo. Okay? Itong pangalawa naman, again, this one, 49, malapit na siya sa 50. So, I can, what I can do would be turn this into 50. This will become 81. So, now you have 131. So, again, ang uh, it pays to do that kasi kung hindi, isusulat mo pa siya sa gilid, 82, tas 49, tas magkikerry-kerry ka pa. So, ganyan, 1, 1, tas tsaka mo makukuha 131. Again, same answer. Hopefully, this method will get you to answer the question faster. Next, 932 plus 84. So, pupunuin natin yung isa sa kanila. Okay, you have options here. Again, what you could do would be, gabi nyo tong 80. Uh, this is an alternative way, no? So, 80. Tapos yung 4 na to, idadagdag ko dito. So, 936. Bakit? Kasi yung 80 tsaka 936, madali na yan. Bubuoyin ko lang yung 1,000. So, 1,000 and then yung natitira na 16. Kasi basically, yung ginawa ko, yung 936, ginawa ko siyang 920. Sa utak ko, so 920, 80, and 16. Kasi yung 920 tsaka 80, that is 1,000 already. Nadagdag ko lang yung 16. So, 1,016. Okay? Next, ito. Again, this is really simple naman. Kasi, ano to eh, tatlo na lang, 500 na siya. So, I can turn this into 500. Kukunin ko yung tatlo dito, magiging 326 siya. So, in here, you have 826. Sabi, what is the mean of this data set? So again, uh, what I showed you in the video lesson, you can manipulate these fine relationships. So for example, itong 86 at saka 90, 4, 6, and 4 is 10. So pwede ko na lang siyang gawing 90 at saka 90, which will give me 180. So yan yung bigger chunk dito sa dalawang ito. So hindi ko na sila kailangan isipin. Ito naman, 82 at saka 88. Yung 2, pwede ko na lang ilagay dito, magiging 90 siya. So itong 82, magiging 80. So I have 170. Okay, so again, hindi ko na siya pwede, kailangan isipin. Dito na ako sa 65. Now, what I can do here would be yung 20, kukunin ko dito para maging 200 siya. Okay, tapos 45 na lang siya bali. Tapos itong 30, pwede ko rin kunin yung 30 na kulang para maging 200 ito dito. So, mag matitira siya kanya is 15. This will turn into 200. So, 415 na lang siya. 4, 1, 5 divided by... 5 kasi 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 numbers na pinag-uusapan. So, here you have 8. So, 40. And then 15, which will give me 3. So, the answer is letter D, 83. Okay? So, again, ang goal here is for you to be faster. Para pagdating sa exam, hindi nyo kailangan isulat na lahat na 86, 94, 82, 88. 65. Tapos i-add ng 6 plus 4 plus 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 ganyan. Para lang makabawas-bawas dun sa, dun sa ganong klaseng uh, pagsosolve, hopefully nakatulong sa inyo yung technique na tinuro ko sa inyo. Okay? Now, um, thank you for watching this video. I hope na may natutunan kayo. Don't forget to hit like if you learned something new. That it actually encourages me. The fact na mas mar marami ang nagla-like kaysa na nag sa nag din dislike kahit meron din mga tao who do that. Um, so, I appreciate those of you guys who take the time to do that. And if you have any friends who are taking exams, then you can share this with them. Again, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get the new videos that I'm posting really, really soon. So, thanks guys. And uh, if you want to reach out to me directly, you can go to www.facebook.com slash teamlaika for yung mga live review events, online review program, the reviewers that I made. If you're interested in any of that, you can reach out to me directly there. Thanks, guys. And as we always say, never stop learning. Aja, aja, kaya I'll see you in my next video. And bye for now.